What up, YouTube? So I bottled up my mead. I didn't want to wait till the 21st. I tried a sip of it, and it gave my tummy a little alcohol burn. So that's how I know it's ready. So I transferred my mead to a clean bottle. I did a video of that that's uploading right now. A drinking stream. I might just do that, to be honest. I was getting a little impatient, and I didn't want to wait till the 21st of September, and I didn't really have to because it's fermented. The balloon on top barely inflates, so the carbonation on that's died down a bit. I like making my own homemade hooch. It's very rewarding. Of course, splashing that in there. That tastes like mead. That tastes like just like mead. I've had mead before, the honey wine. Cheers, folks. I don't have another glass of that. That tastes just like mead. Now, will it actually get me drunk? Well, we're going to find that out, aren't we? You can avoid getting botulism if you're careful with it. That's why I digress strongly that if you're going to make your own homemade hooch, you got to be careful doing that. Do a drink combo. I'll, I'll combine this drink into my stomach. <laughs> no, I am uh, clean on that. I've got myself checked at the health clinic, and I haven't had sex before or since the checkup. So I know I'm clean. Circle of protection around. Myself from getting botulism. I was gonna wait two more days, but I'm like, man, I can really go for a drink right now. I haven't been drinking as much, you know, cutting down on that. So I'm like, fuck it, bottle it up. And took the label off the fresh bottle, rinsed it out with hot water, and then poured the mead into here. I didn't bother using the filter, the, the strainer, like I did, like I said I was gonna do. Because I didn't use it, use it last time, so I'm like, oh. So yeah, we're gonna bust out the uh, homemade me or the homemade glass here. I'm gonna wash this out. Nah. Don't you dare drink it all. Why don't you fucking make me, dude? If I drank this entire bottle of homemade mead on stream. You'd all sit there and watch and go, damn, Cobra. The glass is a little dirty, yes, but it's all right. I ain't going to die from drinking this shit. And quite frankly, YouTube, if I did die, then what the fuck would my trolls do? My trolls wouldn't have anything. The only thing they have in life, the only joy they have in life is harassing Cobra, and it's kind of sad, to be honest. You can avoid getting botulism when you're making homemade mead, if you're pretty sanitary about it. Based off of my fucking liquor research, you can pretty much make homemade hooch out of any flavor of juice you want. This makes me a happy Cobra. It drinks like a mead, it tastes like a mead. And uh, I'm not going to lie, I'm feeling a little, uh, a little obnoxious. It's what I got to say to the Christian comments. Just pretty much fucking ignore it. I've done my research. I've seen several videos on how to make Pruno and, you know, based off of the research... I'm like, the results do not lie, YouTube. This mango Tampico mead is delicious. That's probably a DoorDash order. Maybe one of my trolls sent me some more cat food to be funny. Like, Cobra's getting drunk on stream, so let's fuck with him. And it's like, well, I'm not going to answer that. You don't get the satisfaction of watching Cobra go, 
Oh, hey, guys, you sent me cat food again. Oh, jeez. And, of course, you know that the trolls are fucking with me, or it's either my fans, one of the two. I'm not answering the door on streaming. And my trolls will do anything they can to fuck with me. You know what I'm saying? They'll harass the Casper Police Department. They'll fucking send me cat food, and it's like... Fuck them. And, it, you know, I'm not going to fucking answer it. It, it, it. It's like if the Casper Police Department are here to check on me again, it's like, dude, I'm fine. I'm like, you can see the fucking sign on the front of my fucking door. Ignore the trolls. Blah, blah. You know what I'm saying? That's how you know I got to my trolls because I, I put a sign on the front of my door that says, ignore the trolls telling you to ignore the sign. If it's paid for. Leave it at my door. And I will gladly accept it after my stream. Get off live, boy. Why don't you make me, you fucking pussy? No one's forcing you to watch my videos, dude. Straight up. If you don't think... You know what? I'm not going to respond to the haters in the chat. Because it's not worth my time. Based off how I'm feeling right now, after a couple of sips of it, I would definitely serve this to my Viking ancestors. As somebody who's a high-functioning alcoholic, uh, fucking, I'm happy with the way that mead turned out. It's got a little bit of bite to it. I'm high-functioning autistic, so I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. A low-functioning alcoholic will deny they have a problem. A high-functioning alcoholic will acknowledge that they have a problem. And they'll either better themselves by cutting down or, like, you know. You want to ask questions like that because you believe everything you see on the Internet. The problem with being King Cobra JFS is I have so many fucking haters who love to exaggerate the truth because they're jealous of Cobra. I'm not afraid to be myself. And that triggers people. Another documentary? Yeah, I'd be down to do it. I don't like the way the last documentary painted me. You know, the dude was asking me questions about my childhood. And being like, so, and then when I sat there and I'd go off on my stories, he tried to, to treat it like I was just some rambling, stupid autistic. And I'm over here like, you asked the questions, you made the effort to come out and film me, so then why the fuck are you going to get pissed off when I give you what you want? It, it doesn't make any sense. And they tried painting it like, Oh, at this point, Cobra had too much to drink, and we had to take him home. And it's like, you don't know my fucking alcohol limit. You don't know, you know what I'm saying? Where's the soup? I ate it all. I ate that goddamn soup in like two days flat. Day after I made it, it was gone, because it was that good. That tastes like some mango mead. I'm drinking my own homemade mead. Like, I've got nothing to gain from lying about the mead getting me drunk, so what the fuck, dude? What time is it? All right now it is 2.14 in the afternoon. I want it that way. It's not delusions. People love my singing voice. Otherwise, I wouldn't have 70,000 subscribers. That's the thing of it. To be honest with you, I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing with the alcohol. I've just done a bunch of fucking research and watched a bunch of Pruno making videos. So I'm just going off the research. Even if I drink the entire thing on stream, you know what I'm saying? Fucking... 
<coughs> Excuse me. Uh, my trolls need to get alive. Uh, banned. If anyone's a fucking sicko, it's my fucking YouTube trolls. Because what kind of sick bastard goes out of their way to troll somebody with autism? It's like, oh, we called Cobra a sicko live. I want him to freak out about it and fucking get mad. Like... You know I hate sickos, and this is the only reason why you're saying or doing shit like this on stream is because you want a reaction. Like, I'm going to spam Cobra's chat with calling him a sicko because I'm so jealous of Cobra I can't stand it. Yeah, ban all the sicko comments. To be honest with you, I hate sickos more than I hate my fucking sexual dry spell. And if I can sacrifice all the sex and the masturbation and sexual gratification in the world to end sickos, I'd totally fucking do it. And you calling me a sicko just makes you look fucking desperate for attention. At the only the only reason you're commenting at this point is because I'm banning you as they come in. And it's giving you attention. Watch what happens when I completely fucking ignore all the fucking asshole sicko comments. I got all day to fucking ban sicko comments. Come on, keep them coming. I'll just click ban, block, delete, ignore. Like, I know what I want to do. Cobra's going live. I want to spam his fucking chat. Like, oh, I know. We tried sending Cobra cat food. That didn't work. All your sicko comments are getting hidden. This does not affect me in any way, shape, or form. I'm never going to change. And it's so obvious my trolls are sickos, otherwise they wouldn't harass Cobra for hating them. You know, you're going to harass Cobra for being one of the good guys. It's like, wow, dude. Your life is fucking sad. People are watching the chat blow up, and it's like, boom, 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 boom. Like, now you're giving me trolls to slay. This is too much fun. I fucking hate sickos more than I love drinking. You know, my autism tells me I hate sickos more than I love Ozzy Osbourne, and y'all can fuck off. Cobra hates sickos, so we're going to try as hard as we can to fucking make him look like one. That's just fucking sad, dude. Like, oh, ha, 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 we got Cobra. Everything you fucking say right now, shit like that, just proves I'm winning. And that my trolls are triggered by everything that I do. They sit there and text me, Oh, Cobra, you better not go live. I swear to God, if you go live, I'm gonna freak out and send you cat food. And I'm over here like... Like, we're going to spam Cobra's chat with you are sicko fucking bullshit comments. And I don't even get mad at it or hardly react to it. Just delete, block, ignore, delete, block, ignore. And it's like, thanks for giving me trolls to slay. I found that quite entertaining, to be honest. I don't mean to sound like a broken record, but if you went on YouTube and said, I hate sickos, and then everyone and their mother tried as hard as they can, to make you look like the opposite. You 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 get sick of it, dude. Well, Cobra's drunk, so let's obsess over calling him a sicko. It's like thanks for watching my YouTube live stream. <clears throat> you don't have to donate, but Cash App and PayPal is the best way to donate. You wanna see Cobra do a food hack? Maybe another homemade wine. You know what I'm saying? Greatly appreciated it. Aided, blah, appreciated it if you do. It's not e-begging when it's a uh, goddamn business exchange. The trolls are trying to psychologically manipulate me. And uh, I'm not falling for it. I'm aware of how psychology works and how the human mind works. 
I'm not as stupid as people perceive me to be, but if they think I'm stupid, let them think it. Let them think it, Cobra fam. I've researched the uh, effects of botulism and thus far after drinking a couple of glasses I don't have any side effects so there you go mm. Mm. Another delivery. Well, thank you for that. I appreciate it. I'm not going to answer the fucking door when I'm streaming. You don't like it? That's just too damn bad. You can read the sign, can't you? Like, thank you for the, the uh, DoorDash delivery. I will check on it when I fucking get off live special instructions for doordash when you're delivering this thing fucking knock as hard as you can so you can interrupt his stream i'm not stupid dude i know how my trolls operate Yes, I didn't order anything. My YouTube fans and trolls are being assholes. Yeah. They think that's funny. Yeah, they, they 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 do. They know I have Asperger's. How are they able to do that under? I don't know. At least they're not swarming. What's that? Swarming? Yeah, they swarmed me in the past. Do you have a fish? Do I what? Do you own a fish? No, I do not. No, I don't. I don't know what to do, to be honest. Look, if I order it, you know what I'm saying? It comes from my actual email and not from some random, you know what I'm saying? Yes, please do that. Don't even. Okay. I have a bearded dragon. I don't have gold bears. Okay. If you have a cat, there's a can of cat food. You go and ask to do. I don't have a cat. Right. Yes, yes, it's not a problem. I'm sorry, you have to deal with that. All right, thank you. Yes. Hey, you know what I want to say to my YouTube trolls? Thank you for buying cat food and goldfish food because that goes towards people who want to have a pet but who are struggling on the budget. That's how you deal with that situation. You see how I didn't yell at them and I explained the situation very calmly. And that's going to piss off my YouTube trolls because from now on, you know, if DoorDash is made aware of this, then that kind of foils your plans. And you heard that, like, the, the woman in the background, she's like, they think this shit's funny. And I'm like, yes. My YouTube trolls think it's hilarious to try as hard as they can to bully an autistic. And it doesn't work. So now, like, every time I get cat food or goldfish food or whatever fucking stupid food, you know, if I didn't order it, you know what I'm saying? Then, yeah, we took care of that, YouTube. And you might be sitting there giving me laugh reacts like, Oh my god. <laughs> like, hey, Cobra, we're gonna fucking harass you with DoorDash. And I'm like, I just nipped that in the Asperger's. You don't gotta donate to PayPal or Cash App, but it's greatly appreciated.
Like, do you have a goldfish or a cat? And I'm like, no, I got a bearded dragon and I love him to death. I don't take Puff out of his tank too often except to exercise, get a bath, and relax. Mainly because I can tell he's content when he's in his tank. Like, I don't go out of my way to harass my trolls. I fucking hate sickos more than I love Ozzy Osbourne. Uh, I fucking love Puff. He's my favorite fucking lizard. I gave Cobra some cat food to troll him, and then the first video he made, he eats the cat food, so we're going to keep doing it to see if he'll eat the cat food continuously. And it's like... Well, uh-huh, you know, and then like, you know what I'm saying? Communication is everything, to be honest. Tactical self works, but it's just, it's how you play the game, you know. You gotta wait patiently and just do your thing, and then, uh, you know, even if you have somebody. Oh my fucking god. You think the trolls would get sick and tired of this shit? Like, you see the fucking sign, I'm not gonna fucking answer the door if I can help it. I ended up answering the door last time, and it just pissed off the trolls to the point where they had to send me more dumb shit. Like, oh my god, we heard a knock on Cobra's fucking stream. Piece of fucking shit. And I think that's what makes Ozzy Osbourne and his family re relatable because it's like if I keep knocking, maybe he'll answer the door. And it's like, no, I don't gotta answer shit. You can read the fucking sign, can't you? If it's paid for, leave it at my door. Like Cobra. The door is answering, and it's like, I'm not going to answer shit. I'm not going to fuck. If it's fucking paid for, then leave it at my door. I'm like, if I get botulism, it is what it is. It's worth the sacrifice because it's that delicious, and it works. And furthermore, if you're super sanitary about making it, you ain't going to get botulism. I won't get botulism. No, I won't get botulism. <coughs> Excuse me. This goddamn liquor, it's fucking delish, dude. I'm not trying to be like fucking be obnoxious and be like, <laughs> you know, stereotypical drunk asshole. And making your own alcohol is a labor of love, even if it's like some cheap fucking, you know. I wasn't keeping track on the fucking aging process, but from my experience I could have let the fucking mead age for like two more days but it, it honestly wasn't needed because holy shit I made homemade wine but like I feel retarded after drinking all this Mango mead. I fucked Cyrax. I fucked the sickos. But I let it age till the 19th. And that was definitely more than enough. Mm.
you know, for those folks who are looking for an economy fix. Holy shit, you two. They're like, fucking the wine snobs are like, This mango juice is so good that I don't want to drink the whole thing in one sitting. I may save a little bit in my fridge. Because it's like, okay, Cobra, you got to cut down eventually. I don't have to cut down, but like, you get the. I hope you all are fucking having a beautiful fucking Tuesday because I'm feeling pretty good. I'm content with what I've had in my system. Like this is the last drink. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Before I make my, <coughs> no, excuse me, my other batch. People are not going to keep knocking on my fucking door, Jesus Christ. Can I help you? Oh, it's the back, man. Oh, my fucking down. Oh, yeah. hold on, what are you up to? Nothing. No, I didn't pass that on my live stream. I was ignoring people who were sending me DoorDash and then me ignoring it not to give them a reaction. Oh, well, sorry, you gotta deal with that, dude. Yeah, I'm gonna get some homemade Like, oh yeah, I gotta be super fucked up towards Cobra because we hate his fucking videos. Like, oh yeah, you know, that's how you know I pissed off my fucking YouTube trolls. Because it's like, oh wow.
We gotta figure out what's in Cobra's homemade alcohol. Over here, like, whoa, yeehaw. Over here, like, oh, hey, you know. Like, oh, oh, Cobra, we're going to check your fucking blood pressure and make sure you're okay. What's in your homemade mead? And I'm like, uh, honey, Tampico peach and some sugar. I don't going to do any of this crap to fuck with my trolls. I really don't. So all my trolls are sitting there going, oh, we got Cobra. We fucked with him. <laughs> 